am uh, Dilrukshi Ramukwella. Uh, I've been the administrative secretary for 15 years and my total service is about 23 years. I'm completing in March. Um, just the, how the, you all know Lionel went, died in his sleep in 1944 and uh, his brother and his uh, friend Harold Pires wanted to do something in his memory. Lionel Wendt is a musician, a concert pianist, artist, and a photographer. So they wanted to do something in his memory, so the best way to uh, give him a tri uh, do the tribute to him is to build an art center in his memory. So that's where we are today. This was his home, converted into an art center. Anavent is the home for all the most of the artists here. Or they call it the artists call it the home because they, this is where they all started, and this is a well-designed, small, intimate theatre. And it's up to now this is the only theatre in Sri Lanka, in my opinion. To have a to perform on the Lionel Vent stage is like having a um, playing a match at Lords, that's what they say. The highlight of the Lionel Vent is the acoustics. It's so good. And uh, you don't need, if you speak on the stage, the person in the balcony can be heard very clearly. And the fly bars, we have 12 fly bars. This is the, the feature of this place. Apart from that, we have 621 seats. And anywhere, if you sit anywhere in these 621 seats, you can see the stage very clearly. That's another feature of this place. Proper architect, the architect who has built this place. Uh, it was designed by Mr. Harold Pires, who initiated the whole thing. 
and uh, Jeffrey Beeling, who was an artist, who himself was an artist. And uh, the way they have designed it uh, is, is unique. When we go into the, to the details of it, you can, I mean, at that time in 1940s, 50s, how they have the knowledge to do this is amazing. Art Centre has two galleries, but uh, Downsia Gallery is, like, we call it the Lionel Wendt Gallery, uh, which was built, opened in 1957. The architect there is a lady called Jane Drew, and there are the, the, how the natural light comes in from all directions, and the air circulation, how they have thought of that is, is some, simply uh, amazing. It was opened in 1953. The first play staged here is Maxim Gorky's Lower Dip, uh, directed by Numan Jubal. And Airangani Sera Singer took part in, which she's still around. She's the only person, actually. Uh, so since then, we had nine, Maname, first production of Maname was in 1958, and Singhabau in 1962, then Karadiya, uh, Nala Damayanti, all uh, Chitrasena Vajra's place and Sarai, Professor Sarachandra's place, all happened here, started here, most of it. And uh, it, this place is line of end stages like the bridge where the Singhala theatre meets the English theatre. The lighting console you saw outside, it's, it's operated manually. It's the second console we had. Uh, I mean, it's a un, uh, museum piece now. And those lights, what, what we used in the 50s and the 60s, we have, have it for display there. Uh, I don't think even the Strand Company still has any of these features, but we have preserved.
outside and that small garden area is that that pond the story says was there when Lionel went was living in the house in this house it was it was small we have a photograph in the foyer uh, that is called the number 18 that's that pond is still there in that photograph and the mural the wall art we got it done Chambika Jawadana did it for us Harold Peters Gallery was opened in 2000, year 2000, with the exhibition of uh, Centennial Tribute to Lionel Wendt. Uh, it's it's an exclusive gallery where we have uh, air conditioning and uh, one of the best galleries in Colombo. Anilvent Theatre is equipped with fly bars, uh, orchestra pit, and we have the rehearsal room for your rehearsals. And the rehearsal room is, is exactly the size of the stage for performances that is happening here. That's an additional uh, facility that we provide. And we have lights, which is enough to, we have all the theatre lights, which is enough to do a, a theatrical performance. And we have the best sound system a DNB sound system if you want to use sound and the lighting lighting is also another key feature here in the, in the right positions we have the lights and we have 40 odd lights park hands and other equipment also
dress, six dress, five dressing rooms. You can use air condition if you want. And we have a nine, seven foot grand piano for concert concerts. We don't need to be, bring anything from outside. If you want to do a performance here, everything is provided for you here. I want all of you to come and experience the the theatre. Of, I mean, you will. This is the only theatre in in this country which is uh, maintained and uh, acoustically good. You don't need microphones, and uh, so we want. One thing is we want to preserve this for the next generation. And this is not seven, theatre is now seventy years old, and have it for another. 70 years.